Hi guys, welcome to Run BTS Club. Today we're watching episode 22. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, go. There we go. Oh, but we love the handbooks. So Chuseok and Hangawi are the same things. It's the um, harvest season, harvest festival. And songpyeon is a dessert dish that's made out of rice. Um, it looks like a dumpling, which has uh, different fillings inside. It is pretty traditional to wear hanbok. Um, in Chuseok, but no one really does anymore. Mm hmm. So, uh, if you're good at making songpyeon, um, your children's your children will be beautiful, is basically the thing. But I feel like uh, Korean grandmas just told us that, so we would make it prettier and not mess around. Yeah, we, we eat a lot of chun, which is like Korean pancakes, savory pancakes. Is Jungkook good at everything? <laughs> Ew, he's putting mayo and wasabi and hot sauce.
Oh, that's kind of pretty. <laughs> oh, it's like it's like finding Nemo. The Han River Monster is based on a movie called Monster, uh, which is also directed by uh, Bong Juno, the person who directed uh, Parasite. It's a very famous movie. There we go, our golden mountains. So they made the good songpyeons and also the penalty songpyeons in, uh, including weird ingredients. <laughs> songpyeon Deuce 101. <laughs> <laughs> also, if you're wondering why their handbook is so baggy, handbooks are supposed to be very baggy and uh, very comfortable. Oh, let's go. Yunori is a very traditional Korean game where you throw four sticks and what uh how it lands like how if it lands uh back or front that uh will tell you how many spaces you're allowed to move. And uh, you can, if you make it out, that's one point. But if you uh, 
want to, you can steal or eat someone else's place and then they have to go back home. See, and then, yeah, since he, they ate them, the pink team ate the teal team, the teal team went back home. And when you eat someone, uh, you can move, uh, you can throw the ute, which are the sticks, again, and move again. And, uh, when all four sticks are landed frontwise or backwise that's either four moves or five moves you get to roll again oh they ate them again yeah it's, it's pretty confusing if you look at it See now, now they have two uh, quote-unquote horses out, so they're in the lead. So if any of the sticks are out, then uh, you lose your turn and you can't move. So you have to throw inside that straw mat. And you can stack like they did. If you're stacked up, you can move together. Maybe we should play Yunori when we get to Korea. Yeah, it's basically a board game where you have to uh, go home. But uh, the Ute, the sticks, are the dice. <laughs> Sugar saying yum yum because they caught them. Caught them again. Ha <laughs> ha. Called a ref. <laughs> so competitive. Everyone's so serious. Did they make the horses out of Songpyeon? Caught them again.
Yeah, people get into a lot of fights playing this. Oh no, it's out. So you, you know how Sugar said, oh, I'll let you ride the bus? That kind of means like, oh, I'll take care of everything. I'll, I'll carry us. See, now since uh, it was all backwards, he, he can throw it again. But you know that even though if other people are winning, you can always catch up. Oh, they caught him. And Jin and Jimin won, so they're out of the game, and now we're fighting for second place. Oh, they're stacked. It's anybody's game. Two spaces. <laughs> and they are out. First of all, that is not in the games that we play in Chuseok, but I guess they put that in just for funsies. But we used to play this when we were younger. Throwing shoes. And of course the elephant spin. Oh. <laughs> Out. Oh, 
Oh no, Jin! <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh, nice. I think Jimmy might be comfortable spinning. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Still dizzy. <laughs> Shuga is trying to be the Hyung and trying to carry V. Okay, Jaggy. Jaggy is it's it's basically a hacky sack game. It's supposed to kick it as much as you can some people are really good at that Pointe. One, two. <laughs> They're talking about the Street Fighter move. Two, three. Four, five, six. <laughs> Two, three, four, five. <laughs> <laughs> oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Jin uh, holding his other foot and like hopping around and trying to slam into other people. We call that chicken fight, and that's also a very traditional game. <laughs> Jungkook being Jungkook Oh, they're playing Takji as seen in Squid Games. Oh, 
It's harder than it looks. I don't know if you've ever played Doxy before. But if you grow up playing uh, Dachi, it's actually really fun. So basically, if you flip it over, uh, the other other person's Dachi becomes yours, and you basically play until uh, people run out of Dachi. Oh, he's taking, taking off the cut. They did a Naruto reference just now. Oh. But the sound is pretty intimidating. They're hitting really hard. <laughs> except except the newspaper. <laughs> except the newspaper. <laughs> Oh, Jin's really good at this game. <laughs> Chocolate tuna <laughs> Chocolate and tuna <laughs> Chocolate tuna <laughs> <laughs> V's dead. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Any questions about the episode? In the first game they played, if you stack your horses and then get eaten, are, are both out? Yes. So it's a double-edged sword. If you uh, stack your horses, you can move them simultaneously because they are stacked. But if you get eaten, then they both go home. How comfy are those traditional shoes? Those traditional shoes are not that comfy. Uh, those particular shoes, we call them 
which literally translates to uh, flower shoes. Um, it's very traditional. Uh, only in like very uh, specific situations you get to wear flower shoes. It's very pretty, but like not very comfortable. In you, when do you use the diagonal line? Oh, so uh, if you land on the space where you have two places to go, <coughs> then you can use the diagonal line. But if you go past it, then you just have to go the long way. What were the squares in the last game? made of and what was the goal oh which which square oh the the dakjis the dakjis are made of paper and the goal is to throw your paper dakji and hit the other person's paper dakji that's on the ground and flip it are hanboks always this colorful uh, most of the modern hanboks are pretty colorful, but back in the day, it depended on your class. Are those sticks like dice? Yeah, basically, they are dice. Is it similar to black rubber shoes? Oh, no, those aren't rubber. Rubber shoes were introduced later on, uh, after around like World War II era. Because they were cheap to make and we didn't have a lot of money. Why why one of the sticks uh has a cross? Oh, very good question. One of the one of the uh sticks has a X on the back. So if one if one of the four sticks is flipped upside down, that is to, which means you get to move one space up. But if that to happens to be uh the stick with the X on it, you move one space backwards. Are you you said normally smaller? Yeah, it's 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 very small. The sticks are usually like uh, the size of uh, your hands. How do you win the paper square game? You flip someone else's paper square. <laughs> Maybe I'll I'll get some Unity for people to play when we go to Korea. I think that's a fun idea. But thank you guys for watching episode 22 and I'll see you guys at episode 23.